What if Karasuno played Mujin Azaka? Defeating a team with a top 5 ace is no simple challenge. Karasuno starts strong, overwhelming Mujin Azaka with their pace. After Hinata gets in a few quicks, Mujin Azaka stabilizes thanks to Kiryu's stability in putting away any set given to him. I see the first set ending 26-24, with Karasuno holding on to their early lead and a Tanaka cross winning the set. Set 2, Kiryu becomes too much to handle, when paired along with the mind of Makiryu Mujinazaka setter. They will look to find weaknesses in Karasuno's wing spikers, winning the set 25-22. The third set will come with proper adjustments for Karasuno, as Asahi and Daiichi show they belong on the court and can elevate their talent alongside the monsters that are Kageyama and Hinata. While Kiryu is incredible, he isn't Ushijima, and Mujinazaka doesn't have Shiratorizawa's talent. So they fall to an Asahi waterfall 25-23.